visit comes as the U.S. is rushing to upgrade this massive 30,000-pound bunker buster, which can be carried by a B-2 stealth bomber and would be used to attack Iran's underground nuclear facilities if it comes to that. The bomb, shown here in mock-up on the manufacturer's website, has been in development for several years. Israel, which regards the Iranian nuclear program as a threat to its very existence, has said there are only six to nine months left before Iran's facilities are so well buried as to be safe from attack. The pressure has triggered threats from Iran to close the Strait of Hormuz, through which nearly 17 million barrels of Persian Gulf oil pass each day. U.S. has warned Iran, both publicly and privately, it will not allow the strait to be closed. And the Navy has now begun a crash project to convert this amphibious ship to a floating forward base that would be stationed inside the Persian Gulf and serve as a mobile platform for minesweepers, patrol boats, helicopters, and teams of commandos to keep the strait open. The ship is expected to arrive in the Gulf this summer.